beautiful picture, beautiful work of art, like a beautiful piece of music, is something that's very inspiring. It's quite difficult to uh, say why one work of art is greater than another. It's just that enough people think it is, which makes it so. I'm Lord Craythorn, and I'm really speaking to you now because when I was chairman of the Works of Art Committee, uh, I was able to bring the Armada paintings uh, in, into being. Just to explain briefly what the Armada was about, it was really Spain and Philip II of Spain, a Roman Catholic country, wanting to attack England and Elizabeth I, a Protestant country, uh, and the, the, the scenes depicted are the Armada ships coming through the English Channel. And you can see the uh, coast of England in all of them because the Armada sailed pretty close to the south coast of England. And the Spanish had an oh, enormous number of troops waiting in Calais to be ferried over to the English coast to uh, invade England. The English sent in fire ships, which literally meant you ignited some ships and pushed them towards the enemy. And the enemy then scattered. In the final picture, the, you can see quite clearly the fire ships in the middle of the picture being sort of launched against the Spaniards. And the, the, the town or, or that you see in the bottom right-hand corner is Calais. <laughs> should have been finished in 1860. One picture was created, and that, of course, was a great help to Anthony Oakeshett in creating the other ones. But this was much the biggest project he's ever tackled. These five pictures, all 15 foot long, and he created them with a series of, there were, at some moments, six artists working on this. With the computer work, the, the, uh, literally the canvas was divided into blocks and it almost became painting by numbers. Young people, I think, create wonderful art, actually, because they're happy to do bold lines and use bold colours and create really wonderful things, probably at a young age more memorable images and more memorable things than they perhaps do when they're double that age. Let your imagination flow onto the paper and onto the canvas. That's the big thing. <laughs>